Today's the day that we're going to the U.S. Open. I'm Bill. I'm Kelly. And this is our This adventure. is our adventures. Oh! Here we go. Um, we cannot take any cameras in, but we can take our phones. So maybe I'll take some pictures and maybe if I can take a couple of videos. I can't take my purse. I can't take anything. It has to be six inches by six inches. So I have like this little thing that enough I can put my driver's license and stuff in. We uh, found out this morning we can walk right here from the campground over to a little parking area. It's maybe a half a mile and they said that they would let us ride the bus over there that is for the media. So we're gonna ride that and take over there. Now, not sure if we'll be able to get back, but we're gonna get over there. It's gonna be a really long day. It is about nine o'clock this morning and probably won't finish up until later this afternoon. Um, I will keep an eye on the dogs with our new camera that I will do a review on later. I wanna use it a little bit before I tell you that I like it or I don't like it. Let's head to go to the tournament. a long day at the golf tournament. Bill got some good videos and some pictures that I hope y'all enjoyed. We are walking back to the camper. We kind of looked out about a quarter of a half a mile from the camper. There was a shuttle. As I said earlier, it was for the media, but it wasn't. It was for volunteers, but they still told us, hey, get on. They took us over there. They brought us back. We didn't have to pay to, um, to any transportation over there and back. We are headed back to check on the puppy dogs now and may go to a place, I think it's called The Barrel. It's a place here close to where we're staying. It's an off-leash dog brewery. Um, just to kind of give Aspen and Belle a time out to enjoy and do some stuff. I don't know how much they would enjoy it, but it might be fun. Also tomorrow, we are moving campsites. We wanted to stay an extra day, but they didn't have another site. So we have to hang around here until about 11 o'clock or so. Hopefully the people that are in the campsite that we are going to will move. But at 11 o'clock we can hook up our camper and just move it around to the other campsite and then we'll head back into downtown Charleston. When we got back to the camper, I've changed because I had to take a shower. You would think golf tournament, just walking around. Oh, there goes a raccoon. You would think that I would be clean. I mean, like I haven't done it. I was so nasty, my feet were black around my ankles. Well, I had to take a shower and wash because I just felt nasty. Now we're headed to the barrel that's in Foley. Foley. See, I'm gonna say Foley a hundred billion times. Something very important by a local last night. We've been calling it Foley. Well, there is a Foley, Alabama. And I know that it's not spelled like that, Foley, but when I saw it, and he saw it, we just, Foley, it just came out. It was a beach town. That's where we were going. It's called Foley. So I'm sure everybody's been going, no, you're saying it wrong. So, yes. So it's on the way to Foley. It is a uh, off-leash brewery. They have a food truck that you can eat at, and then the dogs supposedly be able to run around. We're fixing to go find out. They gonna go get you? Are, are you? are you hiding back there? Oh my gosh, that was so Are leaving 
the barrel. The food was, it was called the, it was a food truck, the Gourmet Pineapple. It was like a barbecue sandwich with like pineapple in it. It was really good. This place, if you had friendly, dog friendly dogs, like our dogs don't think they're dogs, so all these dogs, they're like snobbing their noses up to. But I did some video and the dogs that were, that like to play with other dogs, they were having the best time. I enjoyed so much just watching all the dogs playing together. We are headed back. We're gonna go in, like I said, into Charleston to later tomorrow, back into Charleston downtown later tomorrow. We're going to bed. I know the sun's still up, but my eyes are gonna be closed. I decided I was going to do a little bit of run this morning. Not that we haven't walked enough. We walked like eight miles yesterday, seven miles the day before. I just wanted to clear all the cobwebs on this trail for anybody that walks on it later. Because I think there's been like a billion. <sighs> I've run a few miles so far. I'm probably going to run maybe about another one. Never how far it is back to camp. And then... We'll get ready to move the camper to its new spot for one more night. Just finished a three mile run. Now it's time for some coffee. So we just moved over a few spots. Now I am going to get a shower, get dressed, and we're going to head into downtown Charleston. Oh, we are back downtown in Charleston. We're going to go eat at the Tiger, what was it called? Tiger. tiger. You said lion. Then I found tiger. The Blind Tiger Pub. It was one of the stops that we had stopped on the pub tour. We just kind of liked the vibe and it looked really good and the appetizer had was really nice. Buffalo cheese fries. They're really good. Just ate at the Blind Tiger. I had the Nashville hot chicken sandwich. So good. It was on like a, a sweet bread. And Bill had the turkey avocado. Nope. Nope. Chicken. Avocado BLT. Chicken avocado BLT. And it, chicken avocado club. Club. It was really good as well. The Nashville. The, the, the bread was just so good. It was like almost homemade bread. I don't know if it was or not. We're going to head over to Rainbow Road. I sure do hope this is coming across as pretty because this is just beautiful. All these old trees. Where they used to hang pirates to warn the other ships coming in. It's still pretty, even though there may be hang nooses <laughs> at some point. That is it. 
we are finished here in Charleston. I walked almost 10, well, let me rephrase that. We, I walked 10 miles today. I ran three this morning, and then we walked seven this afternoon, just walking around Charleston, sightseeing, just kind of finishing up the last few things here. Next big trip is at the end of the month. We're leaving, can you believe it? Feels like it's forever ago. We're gonna be gone to Helen, Georgia for half of a week, and then the other half we are going to Stone Mountain, Georgia. See you on the next trip. Wow, Charleston has probably been our number one place we have ever been. I feel like we could have spent several weeks exploring and still not seen everything. This has been a very fun packed weekend. When this video posts, we will be leaving tomorrow for Helen, Georgia. See you on the next trip.